It is 2024. The rains are here again, and Trade More Estate is once again flooded. This recording by a passerby and posted on social media alleged that some persons were swept away by the floods from the estate just a few kilometers from the Namdia Ziki Airport Road. This is Trade More Estate. Two persons just died now. The water took them away. But the Federal Capital Territory Emergency Management Department says this cannot be immediately confirmed. Because I am here with some of the uh, members of the association and none of them has reported that somebody is missing or somebody is dead or somebody got drowned. The FCT authority is advising residents of the estate to relocate to avoid loss of lives. They say 116 structures were constructed on drainage systems and now obstruct the flow of the canal. They lament that residents through a court injunction prevented the government from removing the structure sitting on the waterways which have been marked for demolition. When we came last year, 116, 116 houses were a mark for demolition because these houses are sitting right on the waterway. But we were restrained from removing it. After our assessment this morning, we noticed that some few things were put in place. However, the diversion of the waterways from the main channel, the main natural cause of water flow in the estate, we have seen that that diversion is still there and the houses that were a mark for demolition are still sitting on the waterway. So we are still advising the residents of Treadmore to please evacuate these houses that are sitting on the waterways. But residents of the estate say demolition of the houses marked by the government is not the solution. They argue that obstructions to the canal are caused by newly constructed estates approved by the government. This is why they are proposing a technical solution that is cost efficient and will not cause any humanitarian emergency through loss of accommodation. The issue of flood in Tremor is caused by the adjoining estates that have come in to you know, do their development. They have channeled their waterways into Tremor. Like what happened this morning, if you look at up there now, there is this voice from Nigeria flood that comes from down there and fills up this place. You all can see that this place is a low land. That water, the video that was going around this morning, showed that this place was actually filled up with water. And these are the things that we've identified. Now, now you want to render over 100 and something homes homeless. Have you made any provisions for those people to, where, to have where to stay? So we've been telling them the solution to this thing is an engineering problem. We have a design of some construction that, we, they, that, that have been you know, designated that if government should come in and help us carry out this project, those, the issue of flooding tremor will be solved. So we are calling on government to come and help us. We have the designs, we have circulated them, and it will you know, interest you to know that this project will not take up to 20 million. This thing will be solved. While the impasse between the government and the residents of Trade More Estate continues, millions of Naira of property are frequently destroyed and there is the risk of loss of lives. Ferdinand Duroha, Arise News.